It's been two weeks since I last saw Green. I wonder how he's doing. Do you want to play as Green? Fuck yeah. What is up guys, my name is Zatoros Tamer and welcome back to the Pokemon Adventure Red Chapter Let's Play. We are here with episode 11 today and in the last episode we took on everything to do with the SS Anne and managed to save some Pokemon, some people's Pokemon were getting stolen and big boy us went in and sorted it all out because we're legends. Uh, and in this episode we're going to be, I think we've got a bike race to do, so we're going to be doing that and hopefully taking on the gym. As always, if you enjoy these videos, please hit that like button. As always, the like goal is seven, and my sub goal for the end of the month is 100. So if you could click one of those buttons to help me get to my goal, that would be amazing. Now, let's do a little bit of a team recap. Also, question of the day is on the layout. You know what to do. You guys know what you're doing. But here we've got green, level 26 Bulbasaur with the moves Earth Power, Toxic, Razor Leaf, and Solar Beam. We have Goku, the level 26 Pikachu, with the moves Thunderbolt, Double Team, Thunder Wave, and Quick Attack. <clears throat> Sorry, my voice was going then. And we got Flips, the newly evolved Polyrath, with the moves Bubble Beam, Ice Beam, Hypnosis, and Rain Dance. So, let's go and go to the right. I'm pretty sure... Oh, there's an item up there. Let me go back. Because I think... I'm assuming you can get in behind these buildings. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thought so. Bright Powder. Okay, I don't know whether that's useful. We're not going to go out there yet. We're just going to do the bike stuff. I'm sure it probably unlocks after that. Frankie, you have a bike. Hey, do you want to take part in the bike contest? Yes, great. Sick. Hey, got a proper race team going on. Announcer, attention all con all contestants. Take your position. First off, I would like to thank Miracycle for sponsoring this whole entire event. It's a mere 10 kilometers race, an easy race, but there is little surprise near the end of the... Oh, I almost forgot. I almost gave it away. Anyway, the first to make it to the finish line is the winner. Ha, I'm going to win this competition. In your dreams, mate. Guys, guys, let's not fight. We're friends, remember? Go. Oh. Well, not a proper race, because I couldn't start when everyone else did. Uh, what's this geezer got to say? Can I fight you? I'm going to win this competition. Good for you. The bike looks like it's breaking while we're riding it. That does not look healthy. But we'll pick up this. Contains work up. Nice. And we've got a Snorlax here. Okay. Let's... Uh, I can't squeeze through. Oh, I can't. I have to interact with this. Okay. Why is a huge boulder in the middle of the road? That's weird. What's going on? Snore. Ah, it's a Snorlax. These things can sleep forever. What can I do to make it wake up? I guess I'll just attack it. I mean, that's that's how you deal with most situations, isn't it? If I can't fix it, I'll just attack it. That'll do. So we've got a level 25 Snorlax here. And I think this is red Snorlax. So I am going to attempt to catch this. Um... What am I going to do to weaken you? Razor Leaf. Let's get some some crit damage, hopefully, on him. But yeah, he's fat boy. Belly drum. I mean, okay, you've helped half your own thing. But if you start hitting me, you're going to sweep. So let's throw a great ball and hopefully we get something out of this. So we've got male Snorlax. Hopefully, yeah, we get this. I'll nickname it. Oh, okay. First ball. Did not see that coming. I mean, I guess this is something we're supposed to catch. So let's just Snorlax on the layout, please. Snorlax data was added to the Pokedex. Nice. The mountain Pokemon. When its belly is full, it becomes too... No, the sleeping Pokemon, sorry. When its belly is full, it becomes too lethargic to even lift a finger, so it's safe to bounce on its belly. Why the fuck not? Giving it name to the captured Snorlax. Yeah, I want to call this Fatty. It's just Snorlax, isn't it? It's just Fatty. But what more can you ask for? So, and I want to check out his moves. But yeah, we've got a new addition to the team. Been a while since we've had one of those, so... I want to peep his stats. So he's got Belly Drum, a shit ton of HP, a Chesto Berry, Lick, Belly Drum, Yawn, and Pursuit. Eh. Okay, I'm not a fan of Pursuit, having that on there. That's just for when things switch out. It does, like, double damage. Other than that, I think it's, like, base power 40, so it's pretty shit. But let's let's find the TM. Excuse me, but there, let's find the TM case. What can I teach you? Uh, I, I think he can learn Thunderbolt. I'm going to teach him Bulk Up. I'm not going to teach him Bulk Up because he can't learn that. What's Work Up? It raises the attack and special attack. Yeah. I would want more of the attack and the defense, but that's fine. Uh, what is... Where's this race then? Are they just not really racing? Or... Okay. Oh, this guy, this one wants to fight. You're not going anywhere. I'm going to defeat you and win this competition. 
Alright mate, whatever, fight me then. You little bitch. Biker Kyle wants to battle, he sent out a Pidgeotto. Okay, we're not going to stay in with Green. We're going to head on out to Goku. And Goku's going to slap this up with a 2-2 Thunderbolt. You know how it is. Pidgeotto, use well win. Okay, maybe not then. <laughs> Green's going to come back out. Uh, I can't Earth Power because you're flying. I got, I, I'm going to go back into Pikachu. Please don't swap me out again. That's long. Stop doing this. Run out of whirlwinds already. Right, Thunderbolt. There we go. This should be a one hit. I, I am expecting one hits anyways. Down in one, please. Thank you, Pidgeotto. You're going to be some healthy XP. I want to get Pikachu a little bit of a better. Actually, I don't know. His moveset's pretty solid. I can't really argue with it. Oh, we've got quick attack. Double. I should get rid of double team. I, I know it's a good thing to have, but I've never, ever used it. Let's go into Fatty to kill this. Uh, oh, I want to see a sprite. Oh, big man. Big man on campus. To kill this Ekans, let's... Oh, God, I have trash moves set. That was actually a really bad idea. Let's try it again with flips. The MVP, Glare. Okay, so we're paralyzed, but Ice Beam's just going to freeze you anyway, so I'm not even bothered because it's like a 100% freeze rate, apparently, with this game. But, yeah, also, I've, uh, I've got a couple of things that... We've got one thing on the channel that you'll be expecting in about six weeks, maybe a bit longer. Uh, and a new series that's going to start. I don't know when, but this is pretty confirmed that it's going to start. Maybe by the... What, what day are we in this month? The 13th. Maybe by the end of this month I'll get this going. Yeah, no, that's, that'll be a little goal, actually. Yeah, I'll aim to get this new thing started by the end of the month. i just got to get some artwork. You know how it is. I'm useless with Photoshop. So I've got to get other people to do it for me. But it's all good. Helps everyone out. So Venomous coming out, coming out with Confusion. I actually forget, yeah, Psychic is effective on us because we're apart from fighting type now. But it doesn't matter because you're frozen in a fucking cube, mate. We'll bubble beam because that'll be stab and we should take this down. I, I don't see this living. It's already frozen anyway, so it's not a problem if it does. Stay frozen. We'll just bubble beam and skip through this. And then I'm pretty sure we're going to win the race. Okay, stop giving me this. Stop giving me these power hacks. Thank you. <laughs> Biker Kyle. What? I lost but you're a stupid kid. That's not very nice. I'm just gonna go grab a quick glass of water. Oh, gotta stay hydrated. Ah, that feels better. That feels a lot better. It wound up my desk, so I had to go over. Oh, we lost. So after all that, we lost anyway. Sick. Sick. What a waste of our time. No, I'm joking. And we have a winner. Sorry, kid, but don't worry. You get the second prize for coming second, obviously. Obtain the Sunstone. Hopefully, we're going to use that. Looks like the bike is broken. Better throw it away. The, bi the bike's broken. What did the bike break from? What did it break from, exactly? All right, whatever. Fair enough, if you say so. If you say it's broken, then I guess I believe you. Um, we'll go into the Pokemon Center and heal up the squad. And right, let's let's fully do a little. What can he learn? Can he learn Toxic? Yeah, of course he can. Everyone learns Toxic. We're gonna teach Fatty Toxic because that'd be cool. Um, push you. We don't need that. Yawn's good because he can get us send them to sleep. We we need fucking uh, double edge or something. Something mad. So, we're going to go behind here and see if we can take on the gym now. Because I'm sure we've done everything in this city. Like, we should be moving on now. Uh, okay, we just got a random Pikachu here. And Surge with his fucking trash cans everywhere. You know how it is. Uh, and the letter. That's not a gym leader. The gym leader of Amelian City had a friend. A friend that he cherished with all of his heart. When that friend died, it destroyed him. He abandoned everything. His life, job, responsibility, family and himself. What? Huh? Don't be startled. I'm just a harmless ghost. Uh, okay then. What, what do you want? I've been waiting for a long time. Please, please place my remains in Lavender, in Lavender Tower so I can leave this lonely world behind. Fucking hell, that just got a bit dark, didn't it? Jesus Christ. Red put the urn in the key items pocket. Bonus chapter, abandoned gym. Okay, that got a bit, that got a bit real then. Abandoned gym. Wait, am I supposed to do something in here? Oh, mate. I... It's all eerie because there's no music either. 
Right, I'm going to click A on all these trash cans because they said there was a bonus chapter. It was like the abandoned gym. Maybe it is the quest with the... With the, uh, that probably makes a bit more sense. But, oh no, no, there's nothing there. Okay, I suppose onwards to Lavender Town? I'm guessing. I'm just going to speed up through this route. We know what's here. We know what's going on here. We literally did all this when we came through with a bike. So we're going to... Oh, okay, okay. We've got a, bit of, got a bit of story time, lads. It's been two weeks since I last saw Green. I wonder how he's doing. Do you want to play as Green? Fuck yeah. Green's Tale 1 chapter. I mean, that means chapter 1. Two weeks ago. So this is Lavender Town. The place where the living and the dead live together in harmony. Charmeleon. Come on, Charmeleon. Let's bury our friend. Fuck me. This is some deep shit. I can't even look at your team. That sucks. Wow. So look at that. Playing as green. That's fucking sick. Oh, wow. I'm just going to... Go in here. I want to. I want to see what happens if I heal. What? Here for healing. Put your Pokeballs on the table and step away. Take your Pokemon and leave you trash. What the fuck? Everyone in this town's a bit of a dickhead. Hello, I'm a fortune teller. Do you want me to read your fortune? It costs only. Hmm hmm. I can see that you're a trainer. Thank you. There's no refunds. What, what a little bitch. What the fuck is? Oh, is this Martha? I just want to be loved by my mama. Everyone in this town's a fucking arsehole. I'm not from around it, but people sure are rude. Yeah, don't you know it? What's this little kid got to say? Go away, you're a stranger. Go away, you female houndoom. Did you just call me a bitch? The wanker. Fucking hell, okay. What have you got to say? Stay away from... Shut up, I don't care. Yeah, Green, Green's had enough of this. Okay, we've got a doe duo here. Hmm, a doe duo? Okay, and this Mr. Man's coming here. Oh, God, you found my doo do 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 duo. Thank you so much, young man. My do my do duo is getting old. He occasionally wanders off. But couldn't you see him from out your house? I was so worried. Don't scare me like this again. <clears throat> you look really familiar. You kind of remind me of my friend Samuel Oak. My name is Green Oak. Samuel Oak is my grandpa, as predicted. <laughs> I can definitely see the resemblance be between the two of you. Your grandpa and I go way back. Let me introduce myself. I am Mr. Fuji. Nice to meet you. Hi. Oh my, why are we even talking in this rain? Let's get out of this storm first. I wouldn't want you to catch a cold. Okay, so I'm taking it. We're going into that house over there. I mean, that's cool. You know what? It's, you know what? It's pouring outside. Why don't you rest here tonight? I guess I can do... I guess I can do the thing tomorrow. Thank you. Oh, we're going to rest on this chair. Da -da -da -da. The next day. Hmm... Oh, you're awake. You're a deep sleeper, aren't you? How long have I been sleeping for? Hmm. Where's your doduo? My do my doduo passed away this morning in his sleep. Fucking hell. We're getting a lot of Pokemon dying stuff at the minute. He's in a better place now. I'm sorry for your loss. It's all right. My, do my doduo lived in a lived a ripe... Let me try it again. It's all right. My doduo lived a ripe old age. I'm just glad that I was able to be with him until the very end. Oh yeah, I'm curious, Green. Why are you visiting Lavender Town? We don't get many visit many tourists or trainers. I'm here to bury my Raticate. She was injured on the SSN. I couldn't get to the Pokemon Center in time. My Raticate didn't make it. Fucking hell! We got a very dark, stark, undertony sort of episode going on. Jeez. Oh no, that's terrible. It's my fault. I was too headstrong and overly confident. Anyways, so now I'm here to bury my Raticate in the Pokemon Tower. No, not the Pokemon Tower. That tower is haunted by ghosts. Ghosts don't exist. But it's true. Whatever, I'm going to the Pokemon Tower to bury my Raticate and at the same time show you there's no such thing as ghosts. Okay, off to the tower then. Flipping hell. I just can't believe how, how dark this episode got all of a sudden. Just out of nowhere as well. Grr, I know you. You're that old coot's grandson. You will pay. You will pay. I can't wait to be a fighter and get to just kick her ass. CBA with her BS. Dot, dot, dot. Char, you can feel it too, right? Something isn't right. There are no ghosts here. Only a coward. Come out, you coward. <laughs> hmm. Ah! End of Green's Tale, Chapter 1. Okay. That was a bit mad. That was fucking cool, though. That was cool to get to play as, as Green for a bit. Okay, we got battle. 
Brian, the best Pokemon comes out at night. I base this information out of nothing. Seems like most people. Peppy Brian would like to battle. Brian said I need arena. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna speed through these battles. We're gonna earth power this bitch. Hope I'm gonna probably leave it off by getting to Lavender Tower, maybe. Depends on how long that takes. Oh, I've got some potions, haven't I? I know I've got like enough. Come on, let me. Potion six, nice. That's a repel. <laughs> but that'll do. Wait, oh, I'm on fatty. Come on, speed up control. Get it. Right, that'll do. You're a trainer. Okay, I don't think you're a trainer. Kenny, there are many types of Pokeballs. A Great Ball is stronger than a Pokeball. An Ultra Ball is stronger than a Great Ball. Yeah, we get that. I have played this game before, you know. What you got to say? Cliff, I have a friend called D Delia. She lives in Pallet Town. Cool, good for you. Nice. Fishing takes a lot of practice and time. You know what? Shut up. Whoa. That's not being patient. That's just being a rude prick. Razor Leaf will take this down. It's only a magic card. He's going to have a Gyarados at the end, but that's fine. We've got a Pikachu. Well, I'm assuming he's going to have a Gyarados. These level 20s are just easy pickings for us. Okay, you disabled that. We'll just Earth Power. Look. Excuse me again. And a Goldeen. Uh, I, why, why did I click Earth Power? That was so dumb. I'm disabled no more. Oh, I've got so many hiccups, man. I always get this when I start recording. Pissing me off. Uh, okay, confusion hits. Horn attack. Please live. Come on. Thank you. I, don't, I know it's not a Nuzlocke, but I don't like it when things die. Double edge? Uh, no, actually. Stop learning double edge. I don't think it's worth it. You have low HP. The recoil, recoil is just shit. So we'll just heal up green and we'll go onwards and quite literally upwards up here. Because I want to see what's up here. Oh, we're at a graveyard. Another graveyard. Fucking hell. Oh, I'm going to... Uh, sorry for running over graves, but I want to get the items, please. Um, What have these people got to say? Sophie, I've made some choices in my life that I'm not proud of. Jeez, man, this is so dark. Oh, okay. Mum? Oh, it's my mum! Shit! Honey, I really miss you. What are you doing in the graveyard, mum? I'm here for Delia. Who? Thank you, my... Mailer, I'm ready to head back to Pallet Town. Are you sure, Delia? We can stay a bit longer. No, it's okay, really. Thanks, Mailer. Why, you must be red. Nice to meet you, Delia. Young man, where you, where are your manners? It's Miss Ketchum for you. Ah! Ah, we all know who that is. S sorry, Miss Ketchum. Haha, <laughs> it's alright. Nice to meet you, Red. Mailer, I'm going to, see, I'm going to say goodbye to Cliff before we leave. Oh, Cliff was the one in the uh, house. Poor woman, she has no one left in her life. Her husband, Pete, is dead. It's really such a shame. He was a handsome, charming, and kind to his friends and family. I remember getting really jealous whenever I see Delia and Pete together because they were always so happy. But good things never last, son. I can still remember the day when Delia heard the news that Pete died in the war. She cried and cried, and eventually she stopped crying. But she never smiled. Not the same way, at least. You can feel pain behind that smile of hers. Doesn't Miss Ketchup have a son? Dot, dot, dot. Mum? Well, look at the time. i got to go. Take care of yourself, Red. Make mummy proud. <laughs> Couldn't quite tell us about Ash, but okay. I hope he's somewhere in the game. I'm sure... I'm sure the developers would put him in the game. Like, it's Ash Ketchum, for fuck's sake. Like, you're making a Pokemon game. You're going to put him in it. Okay, so some more trainers. Serena, in the name of the moon, I'll punish you. Oh, I've got a big stretch. I'll tell you what, lads. I woke up quite late this morning for recording. I woke up at about... When was it? About 10? So, and it, for me now, it's 11 o'clock. So I've only been up an hour, but... Got to get this bread, figuratively speaking. Earth powered in Meowth. Earth powered in Meowth again. Earth powered proving so useful and green. Can't wait till he's a Venusaur and he has that move. Or maybe even a stronger ground type move that you can learn. Okay, you have that. Let's get Flips out here. Let's get Flips some attention this episode. Uh, and we'll Bubble Beam. That, that's going to be a one hit. We're like six levels higher. Yeah, perfect. I don't even think the crit mattered. Skitty, we'll stay in and continue on with the bubble beams. You know how it is. Easy, easy. Nice. Gonna come across here. Lavender Town. Hey! It's raining so heavily. God, I've got to find a place for shelter. No, oh, maybe we weren't supposed to catch. Oh, no. Snorlax is a bit big. Maybe they wouldn't put him in the sprite, in the cutscenes. Um, excuse me. <laughs> Jeez, this lavender town, or leave them their town. <laughs> I need to find a shelter badly. Uh, Mosby's residence. Can I shelter here, please? 
Hi, I'm Sailor Ted. I used to work on the SSN. Have you met my friend Greg? He lives in Vermilion City. Yeah, probably. I might have spoken to him. Genji, after grabbing the tails of a nine tails, I kept getting the reoccurring nightmare where I was a Gengar. Hey, reoccurring nightmares are fucking peak. Actual peakest. Um, Fuji, are we going to have to go here? I'm sorry, but where can I stay until the rain stops? Sure, of course. A few hours later. Thank you. You know, I was surprised that you even allowed me to stay in your house. Everyone else in this town is so rude. People here have become slaves of their own fears. Come with me. Uh, mind if I ask what you're doing? Just pay my respect to Dodua. He lived a, he lived a ripe old age, but his time had come at last. I also want to pay my respects. Thank you. Do you also like Pokemon? Yes, sir. And Oh, who are you? Where are my manners? Hmm. You can call me Mr. Fuji. After many years, this town is said to be the gathering for the place for the deceased. To honour those souls and give them a place to rest. The people of Lavender Town erected the Pokemon Tower. I can't not laugh at that word, man. You mean that the tower is a cemetery? If it's a cemetery, then why did you build a memorial in there? Well, there's no one dares enter, uh, dares to venture near the tower due to the recent sightings of ghosts. But <laughs> ghosts, he says, Pokemon ghosts. <laughs> you saw the towns, townsfolk's fear with your own eyes. They have become so terrified of ghosts that they have forgotten how to trust one another. They won't even make eye contact with strangers. All I want to do is give my Daduo a nice place to rest in peace instead of this weed-infested alleyway. <laughs> But ghosts, really? <laughs> you sound just like that other mad lad I met called Green. Green? You know that lad? Yeah, he's my rival. Where is he now? Ah, he passed by the town earlier before I lost Oduo. Just like you, when I told him about the ghost, he laughed it off and then ran off into the Pokemon Tower, thinking that he could prove us all wrong. But that was two weeks ago. So Green is missing. What guys? That guy's personality could use some improvement, but as a trainer, he's a real deal. He doesn't go down easy. So what could have put him out of action for two whole weeks? Could it really be? Could the tower really be haunted by ghosts? I need to find out. And that's it. And that seems like a perfect place to end the episode. We'll come in here and just heal up. And guys, if you guys, if you guys enjoyed, please hit that like button if you haven't already. Turn that from grey to blue. And hit the sub bu button because we're trying to hit 100 subs. And if we do, it's going to be fucking sick. So yeah. Guys, I hope you enjoyed the episode. Take care, have a good day, and peace.